everyone, this is Peter. Today I want to introduce is the Lupo Daylight 2000. So, okay, you will ask, okay, ah, Daylight 2000. So is it like maybe the power is pre-equivalent to 2K? Yes, because this unit is now equivalent to the 2K um, Fresnel tungsten uh, uh, light intensity. So you will ask, okay, oh, all right, so 2K, so compare with the Daylight 1000, is it double the, uh, the power? It's true. Then, and then you will ask, okay, is it double the size? No, okay. It's slightly bigger compared with the two, uh, compared with the 1K, but um, I, I can say the size doesn't really like maybe uh, increase a lot, but it's true that because the lens is bigger, it's more powerful, so that means the lens, the, the, uh, the Fresnel lens in front of the LED is actually bigger than the 1000, okay. And uh, then, okay, you said, Okay, it's bigger, so is it much heavier? Okay, it's heavier, but I can still like maybe holding like one hand, holding like this, okay, even like maybe uh, using my fingers hold like this, and then okay, it's, uh, it's heavier, but it's not like maybe extremely heavy, because you know that like if you're talking about the other brands and then maybe uh, equivalent to 2K, probably the size or maybe the weight is already talking about like 30 something pounds and also like maybe they cannot do a lot of things for example like the uh, ACDC but now okay the, the Daylight 2000 is still it still can do the AC and DC which I will show you how to do it okay and then they based on the uh, operations they are probably the same as the 1000 and 650 so at the back here okay you can do the uh, focus let me dim up the uh, the lights uh, a little bit, okay. So you can do focus, for example, like front, spot here, and then at the side here, still like two buttons is controlling the, um, uh, the dimming. And then the other button here is setting the uh, DMX control. It's pretty easy, very easy to operate, no, not the big difference in between the traditional LED, not like maybe some other brand that, like, okay, maybe have a lot of fancy uh, functions. Okay, and at the back here, and then you still got like the DMX in and out, and also you got uh, DC. So you ask, okay, DC, hmm, okay. Because as you said, like the bulb is bigger, much powerful, and then what's the um, power consumption for this? The power consumption for the 2K is 220 volt. Then you will say, okay, oh, okay. How can I maybe uh, drive maybe a uh, one V mount batteries? It's true, okay. This unit cannot drive with one V mount batteries unless your V your V mount batteries is 32 volt. But okay, if I got like 12, 14 point, uh, maybe the normal V mount batteries, how can I do it? Okay, so Lupo give us a solution which is very like uh, versatile. So first, okay, switch off the unit first. Okay, so I unplug. I unplug uh, the. Uh, the AC, I put it here to prove that I'm not using AC. Okay, I'm not cheating. All right, okay. So, Lupo is providing um, a mounting bed like this one, okay, which you can mount the, uh, the V mount, okay, under the yoke like this, okay. All right, so once you do that, they have made a cable which serial the two V-mount uh, batteries together and then just plug it onto the, uh, um, the four pin. Okay, then now the whole operations now is in AC, uh, DC only. So okay, now I, let me put it onto 100%. Okay, and then unplug the unit. Okay, so now the whole thing is actually DC, pure DC now, with a 2K power, with only DC is actually tremendous because okay, now you can, you can actually just moving around or maybe even though you want to have like maybe some light maybe, uh, maybe uh, uh, to hold in the handheld and then running around with the unit or maybe sometimes okay, in some remote area and then you don't have like maybe uh, AC power. Now okay, you can operate maybe such a high power unit with V-mount batteries only. So it's very easy to use, very versatile AC-DC and then okay, on the back of this uh, video, we will probably do a test with the uh, daylight and also the tungsten versions in different lanes, for example, like one to four meters each, and then to see how the loops, uh, the deluxe and also the uh, color temperature plus the CRI is performing. So let's go for it.